Hello and Assalamu alaikum everyone. Uh, today demonstration is about setup of Python in Visual Studio. The first step to install Python uh, environment in Visual Studio is to install Python compiler first. You need to go to Python website in order to install Python uh, compiler. Links will be provided in the description. Uh, so then you need to install, uh, choose between the version. You can install 3.61 or you can install uh, 2.71 version. I am going to install 3.61 for this uh, uh, tutorial. Next step is to install Python tools for Visual Studio which is supported in Visual Studio 2015 and above. So in order to install Python tools for Visual Studio, we need to install that uh, either through Visual Studio setup or we can go to Visual Studio website and download our, our target version of Visual Studio. Uh, if you already have setup with you, you can simply uh, double click your setup. Uh, now click run and uh, you can skip this step uh, at this point. You Maybe you can later update your Visual Studio version. I'm skipping the step. So now now just modify your uh, visual studio and you will see th there are a lot of options available so here we're just going to select python uh, tools for visual studio option click that option and then click next and then simply click update wait for a few minutes and your uh, visual studio will be updated at this point, we have installed all the necessary tools for Python in Visual Studio. So now let's set up Python environment in Visual Studio. Now let's start the fun part and set our Python environment in Visual Studio. So go to tools menu and then choose uh, Python tools and then Python environments. You will see Python environments window. Expand that window and click custom. Uh, now here we're going to add our configuration of our Python environment. Let's start by changing the name of our environment to a more readable form, to a more readable name. Uh, and I will change the name to Python dash 3.6 You will see here some options apply and reset. We will co we'll come to that later. What are these? So let's just set our Python path. Now this is the path where your Python is installed on your system. Navigate to that path and just select the folder and simply uh, move select the folder. Then let's say interpreter path again the, uh, on in the same um, uh, Python compiler folder select the dot exe file for interpreter path and then click open and then set windowed uh, interpreter in same Python uh, folder and now select python w dot exe and click open and then library path again in python uh, path where you have installed your python select the li uh, library part the capital l i b and simply select the folder uh, so now uh, here you see language versions multiple version you can either choose a version here directly or you can simply click auto detect auto detect will simply pick up your python version which you have installed and also the architecture of that python version that is being installed this is the architecture version of python compiler not the uh, architecture version of your machine so uh, be you know very clear about it so now let's set up uh, the environment path so in order to do that we first need to go to uh, windows properties advanced system settings and here we'll click environment variable and notice uh, in system variable section scroll down until you see path variable 
verify that uh, during your installation if you have not uh, uh, select the option to uh, you know uh, map the python uh, folder com compiler scripts path to your system variable if you have have not done that in during the installation you can set here manually or if you have checked that checkbox during the installation of python it will be automatically he here uh, available here just verify that and by editing and see if uh, it's there and then click uh, cancel uh, and ok cancel all right now here type the path name as we have seen there as exactly as there is and now just simply click apply and here our python environment has set up you can see uh, the name and you will see multiple options of python compiler is shown you can see uh, pip here as well which is python in integrated package environment in order to install, import multiple libraries so le now let's create new project and uh, uh, do do a do a run a run uh, test uh, that whether our python environment is working or not choose python and then python application browse and uh, choose the folder uh, location where you want to save your sample project i'm storing it in desktop and changing the name of the project to hello python and then click ok and here is your script you'll see that your hello python project has been created and this is your default uh, script hello python dot py uh, dot py so let's just simply uh, do a little print statement here you'll see when you expand the in python environment you will see that uh, by default because we have set up our environment uh, globally so you will see it will be automatically in uh, integrated with your project but if you have let's uh, say a different version of uh, python you can do that you can change the environment from here and choose the version you you wanted to choose so let's just create a sample print statement with python print i'm just uh, typing a very small script of python you can see uh, just empty prints here just for spacing in order so so we can have better view when we e execute our project uh, so let's uh, print message here hello python world and again print in and just for uh, spacing indentation and then save the project and then start and then you will see finally uh, our script has been executed and our python environment has been successfully set up in our visual studio so here you can see it's been printed all right this is the end of the tutorial thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed this video so take care and have fun